and uh, senior Congress uh, senior Congress leader and former Punjab Chief Minister Captain Amarinder Singh, uh, Singh spoke to NDTV and said that the Prime Minister had been too soft during his tenure and should have cracked the whip harder on the corruption in his cabinet. What has the country reacted to? It's reacted to the 2G scam, it's reacted to the Colgate scam, it's reacted to the umpteens of scams. Who is responsible for that? Is it the Congress President? Or is it, the, is it the Vice President? It is the collective responsibility of government, the cabinet, which is there. Don't, that doesn't mean Dr. Manmohan Singh, but it certainly means his entire cabinet. Has the party not been unfair to Dr. Manmohan Singh in many ways? That's the argument in many quarters. I've been unfair to Dr. Manmohan Singh? Because many have sought to lay the blame at his door. No, it's not his door. But if I'm Chief Minister and uh, there is corruption in my state, then I am the one sitting there. I'm, I should twist tails. And I think Dr. Manmohan Singh was a bit easy on them. And I think he should have been much more forthright mm -hmm. and he should have really cracked the whip when he found, found something happening, like, like happened in all these scams and all that sort of stuff. And things would have been different. So you were saying that Dr. Manmohan Singh... I'll, I'll come back to Mrs. Gandhi, Mrs. Indira Gandhi. Mm -hmm. you, do you think this would have happened in her time? She would have cracked the whip long ago and caught everybody in line. So you're saying uh, the Prime Minister, Dr. Manmohan Singh, actually needs to take a much larger part of the blame? I think he should have been a much firmer Prime Minister. Mm -hmm. He should have cracked the whip and when he saw these things happening, he should have sacked the people from his firm. I know it's the coalition politics, mm -hmm. but I think this corruption comes first. He was totally against it mm -hmm. and he should have cracked the whip and thrown the fellow out, whoever he was.